Oh hey, it's Bingley. And we are back, baby. We are back at the airport, and you're probably thinking to yourself, Bingley, Bingley, you, you cultural connoisseur, you. Well, where are you off to now? Well, I'm about to jump on a plane, and I'm off to Milan. The airport is rammo. I have no idea what's going on. I think maybe it could have been for the uh, the stuff that happened the other day, but Jesus, it is rammo here. Oh, I'll show So this is day two here in Milan. Um, I woke up this morning with absolute torrential diarrhea. So uh, my plans have changed a little bit. So I thought I'd come back around. I don't want to be too far away from a toilet because in case I shit myself. But uh, I've come back to the Duomo. You can see in the background. It's pretty cool. Um, it's, uh, it's nice. I'm not going to go in because I've done loads of churches and cathedrals and stuff like that. But they're always nice to look at and it's like, it's not really like the, the buzz place to be. Um, this is like the square. That's the shopping centre. They've got the square. Uh, I don't know what today's going to be about really. I'm just going to have a little mooch about it. I've done a lot of it yesterday, but um, like I said, my plans got changed and I want to try and try and see a bit of the city, take in the culture, because I am a culture beast. Um, someone's called me that once, well they called me a, some sort of animal, but uh, I've taken that as I am a culture beast. Uh, but I'm going to go check some stuff out. Okay, we're going to go into the, uh, the shopping place, the, the one there, you know, there's loads of photos of it, you'll know it when you'll see it. In the thick of it. So many people here. Oh. Really went over there. Lots of really nice shops here. It's like Prada, Dior, Louis Vuitton. Uh, tried to go in one, but they said that I was too fancy, and I agree, I am too fancy. I'll stick to my TK Maxx and Sports Direct, thank you very much. There you go, there's a shop named after me, the Italian Riz King, Rizzoli. I got the Riz. I have noticed around here that there's lots of really good looking people, good looking people who dress really well. Um, must be why I'm here. Because I'm a good looking person who dresses really well. My mum said. Here we go, look. Look at all those scooters. Lord give me strength. I must not ride these drunk. I'll be banned from another another country. And we don't want that. But it's hard. So behind me is a Starbucks, but it's not just any Starbucks, it's a Starbucks roastery, reserve roastery, something like that. Um, it's meant to be really good, so I'm going to go in and, see, and check it out. Um, it's quite bad because I have got really bad diarrhoea today, so more coffee is probably not a good idea, but I can't miss the chance to, to try a really nice Starbucks. So I've just been into Starbucks, and my God, I feel like a dickhead. Um, I was uh, I was in there surrounded by a group of really beautiful women, and you know, when we was going up to order, we waiting in line. I gave him a menu. I was playing it cool, being a real gentleman. Like they, oh, that they they obviously wanted me, 
and then when it comes up I get my order and instead of taking the tray like a normal person I decided to take the glass and I spilled it everywhere and everyone had to get out of the way and now I've covered in coffee and uh, everyone hates me I'm a right dickhead okay so that uh, that nitro cold brew was was a bad idea I'm gonna have to hot step it back to the hotel because things are brewing Oh hey, it's Bingley. And how about that? We are now on day three here in uh, here in Italy, here in Milan. Um, I didn't do a lot of filming yesterday because I was pretty much um, paralysed by diarrhoea. Um, so I spent most of the day going backwards and forwards to the hotel using the toilet. Luckily they had a, a B day there, which was quite nice because my ass was red raw by the end of end of uh, end of lunch. Um, but uh, yeah, so now we're, uh, we're on day three. Um, this was meant to be yesterday's plan, but uh, obviously for obvious reasons I didn't do it yesterday. Um, but here I am. Um, I'm now at Lake Como. Uh, we just got train up from Milan. It's about an hour. Um, train was okay. Uh, I had to sit in second class, unfortunately, with the riffraff. Yeah, now I'm here in a town called Verena, Verena, something like that. Um, I'm gonna go check it out see what it's about it looks pretty so far from, from what I can tell there's some nice little uh, chalets and stuff um, but uh, yeah I'll go and come with me It's all right. I mean, it's no, it's no, uh, it's no buck steel though, is it? to Bellagio, not the Bellagio Hotel, the Bellagio the town. It is heaving here. There's people everywhere. Fucking hell. Don't people go to work? What's the matter with them? And there you have it. My uh, late coma visit has come to an end. Um, I'm about to walk back and jump on the train. Um, how would I explain my trip here? It's very pretty. It's very busy. Uh, the Campari's a shit. Um, I've had sun cream in my eye all day, and I'll be happy to get up. <laughs> 